hello guys welcome to mr legend crypto guys in this video we'll be taking a look at an altcoin filecoin what's key support levels to pay attention to for filecoin in this bear market we're having a crypto bear market rally right now we're seeing all coins pump on a weekly time frame and a monthly time frame what levels should we pay attention to for Falcon in this bear market rally? We have seen Falcon get to as high as more than $238 by the top of the bull run. In the bear market, it has done pretty well to Goblin Town, losing more than 97% of its value in the process. If we are pumping to higher valuations in this crypto bear market, we are going to start having some problems. And how high can Falcon go in this bear market rally? We'll also be taking a look at Falcon's performance against Bitcoin. Falcon's performance against Ethereum, and then we'll take a look at the Falcon market cap charts. Currently, Falcon has a market cap of over $1.8 billion. We have seen the market cap get to as high as $14 billion. As we are going to higher valuations in this bear market, where will Falcon start facing resistance as we pump into the upside? We'll be talking about that and more in this video. When it comes to investing, nothing will pay off more than educating yourself. If you want to make money long term trading or investing in cryptocurrencies, if you want to get the latest crypto news, price predictions, and chart analysis, this is the channel for you. Let's get down to business. Guys, at the point of recording this video, we're still deep in the crypto bear market of 2022. All coins are down really bad in the last one year. Axis Infinity is down 93%. Luna Classic down more than 100%. Falcon is down 90%. Even the king of the market, Bitcoin, is down 67.9% in the last one year. We have been seeing some signs of life in the altcoin market on a weekly time frame and a monthly time frame. You can see that all coins have been pumping, giving us some gains in the bear market. BNB is up 19%, Dogecoin up 88%, Matic up 43%, ER with up 55%. It has been a good time in the altcoin market in the last 30 days. Even Falcon has been pumping to the upside, going up more than 6% in the last one month and 7.3% in the last one week. This is the Falcon US dollar price chart. We saw Falcon go to the previous bear market, pumping to new all-time highs, getting to as high as $230. But as you can look on the price chart of Falcon, the bear market has been brutal to Falcon. It has been steadily dumping since April 2021. Is the bottom in for Falcon right now? We have to pay attention to the lowest point where Falcon got to in this chart. That's around the $4.9, $4.5 level. If this proves to be the bear market bottom for Falcon, then the next level I'll be paying close attention to for Falcon in this bear market will be around the $10.8, $10.5 level. We saw Falcon rally as high as $10.8 in July 2022. We got rejected off that level and Falcon has been dumping to Goblin Town ever since then. So I won't be shocked to see Falcon get some resistance at this level if we start pumping to higher prices. This will be a very key level for Falcon. When Falcon broke out of the $10.9 level in 2020, we saw it continue pumping to new all-time highs. So if we can get out of this $10.9 level, that will be a good omen that we're ready for higher prices. The next level I'll be paying keen attention to for Falcon in this bear market, guys, will be around the $16.8 level. Falcon might get rejected of that level, but that's proving to be a critical level for Falcon as we're trying to pump to new all-time highs in 2020. We saw Falcon consolidating around that $16.8 region. And when we were ready to pump to higher prices, Falcon went to as high as $238. But guys, there's one support level that might hold us down, one key resistance level that was acting as support for us throughout the bull run. We're shouting, all oh, Kumbaye, we're happy Falcon is going to the moon. And the last time we saw Falcon trading at that level was on the 25th of March 2022. We saw Falcon rally to as high as $27. And after then, Falcon started dumping. And this was the worst of all the dumps. Falcon lost more than 81% of its value in just 80 days. This was very brutal. This was very horrific. Bitcoin got to as low as $17,600. That's what happens in the bear market. You can see a lot of all coins are down really bad in the last one year. A lot of these all coins need to pump really mad for us to go back to the previous price levels where they were in the beginning of 2022. In the case of Falcon, I will not be shocked if we don't see Falcon trading above the $27.73 region in this bear market. Most times, in the bear market, we'll be stuck in this lower end. But when we are ready to pump to higher prices, when we see Falcon start pumping, maybe getting above $27, Maybe even getting to as high as $44, guys. In that case, 
I will believe the bear market is over for Falcon. I believe this $44 region might be the final boss of all bosses. So no matter how we pump hard in this bear market, as far as we know above $42 for Falcon, I will not believe that we are ready to see new all-time highs. But the day we see Falcon pumping above $42, I will believe the bear market is over for Falcon. If you are accumulating some Falcon right now, for us to get to that $42 region, Falcon will have to go up over 600%. I know, but in the bear market, a lot of people are not expecting all coins to pump that well. But as you can see on a weekly time frame and a monthly time frame, all coins can still pump in the bear market. They can still give us those 100% pumps, 200% pump. Guys, I've seen some all coins go 10x in the bear market. If our coin can go through all these levels, then we'll be ready for higher prices. Let's take a look at some details about Falcoin. In the last one year, we've seen Falcon go from as high as $69.64 to as low as $4.76. With a market cap of over $1.8 billion, we have over 316 million Falcoins in circulation. Coin ranked 34 on coin market cap, over 356,000 people have Falcon on their watch list. Why should we hold some Falcon through the bear market? Falcon aims to store data in a centralized manner, unlike cloud storage companies like Amazon Web Service or Cloudflare, which are prone to problems of centralization. Falcon leverages its decentralized nature to protect the integrity of data location, making it easily retrievable and hard to censor, which is important in the climate that we are right now. A lot of government want to censor what you hear. If you believe in Falcon, if you believe this is a project of the future, you want to buy some through the bear market, and you can get some on Binance, on Coinbase, on Wobi Global, on Qcoin, on Gemini, on Kraken, and guys, anywhere you get your popular altcoin. If you take a look at Falcon's performance against Bitcoin, this chart is nothing to write home about. Since when Falcon topped against Bitcoin in March 2021, it has been down to Goblin Town since then. I've seen Falcon lose more than 94% of its value against Bitcoin in the process. The bear market is brutal to all coins. Most times when all coins start dumping, people start selling their all coins for some Bitcoins because when people are afraid in the market, they run towards safety. And safety for us in the crypto market is Bitcoin, it's Ethereum. That's the cryptocurrencies that a lot of people are familiar with. At some point in time in future, when people are ready to go risks on, when people are ready to see the pump again, we'll see Falcon outperforming Bitcoin. It outperformed Bitcoin by more than 663% in just 83 days. As you can see, Falcon has been losing value in the bear market. Can we go any lower against Bitcoin? There's always that possibility of us dumping the bear market. One mistake you don't want to make in the crypto bear market is underestimating the dump. And one mistake you don't want to make when the bull run comes around is underestimating the pump. If they look at Falcon's performance against Ethereum, similar to its performance against Bitcoin, it has been dumping to Goblin Town since the 1st of April 2021, losing more than 97% of its value against Ethereum in the process. Investors lost faith in Falcon, they were trading their Falcon for some Ethereum, and it has been happening, going on for more than 600 days. At some point in time in the future, we are going to see that sentiment change. A lot of people will start trading their Bitcoin and Ethereum back to Phantom because they want to enjoy the pump. The last time we saw them do that and they wanted to enjoy the pump, Falcon outperformed Ethereum by more than 786% in just 56 days. Right now, for Falcon to go back to where it was against Ethereum in March 2021, we have to see Falcon outperform Ethereum by over 3000%. Is that possible? Guys, that's possible, but I don't think that will happen in the bear market. The bear market, we don't usually see coins setting new all-time highs against both Bitcoin and Ethereum. They might pump under USD charts, but will they gain value against both Bitcoin and Ethereum? If you take a look at Falcon's market cap, getting to as low as $1 billion in this bear market, key levels I'll be watching out for on the Falcon market cap chart will be the $1 billion region. What are we going to be doing? When we get back to that $1 billion region, I have a sneaky feeling we might see Falcon still come back to test that $1 billion region. That's where we bottomed out in this bear market. Can we go any lower? There's that possibility. But I think if we can hold this $1 billion region, we'll be ready for higher prices. Other key levels to pay attention to will be what Falcon's market cap is doing around this $2.6 billion region. We got there in July 2022. We got rejected off that level and we had some nice bounce off. That's $2.6 billion region in January 2022. So I won't be shocked if this level starts acting as resistance for us in the bear market. And if we can see Falcon's market cap get above the $5 billion region, guys, I'll be 100% sure that the bear market is over for Falcon and we are ready for a new bull run. But these are the levels I'll be paying attention to for Falcon's market cap in this bear market. 
guys right now we're down in the crypto bear market drop your thoughts in the comment section are you a buyer of more falcon do you believe this project is going to see new all-time highs and you're adding to your moon bag right now in the bear market or are you waiting for lower prices the relief rally we're having in the crypto market where we're seeing all coins going up 50 60 some all coins are even up more than 100 percent in the last one month do you think we're going to see falcon break this 10.9 dollar region in this bear market drop your thoughts about that in the comment section thank you for watching this video Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this. Turn on the post notifications to get notified anytime I drop a new video. See you guys in my next video. Seven, one.